All right, I don't really have the best lighting <clears throat> or the best setup. I just kind of woke up an hour ago, but I want to get these um, unboxed, basically. Just unboxed, pretty much. So I picked these two up when I went to Toronto uh, this past week. I wasn't really going or looking for anything. I was just going there for the family. Um, so, um, as I was there, you know, you stop by these Asian malls and like Markham and stores. And I was like, why not check out if there's any like Gundam or figure stores, which there were. And uh, these took me a while to find. This took me like, this was like hidden. There was like a bunch of SH figure arts that were like hidden in the back of the shelf. So I found this one. I was going to pick up the Ninja Storm one, but I realized that there's two different versions with the Ninja Storm. Uh, a Power Ranger Ninja Storm, and then the Hurricane Ranger. Hurricane Ranger SH figure is like, has way more accessories. So I didn't pick that up. And I just settled for this. I was gonna pick like three other ones. I was gonna pick a, a Vul Vulcan, Sun Vulcan Eagle uh, Sentai, but I opt not to and just, just laid on this one. And then this one, this is like one of the last day I was there, and we were like just running around Chinatown for the lulls, and then we stumbled upon like this like half dead Chinatown mall, where like some of the shops were open, some of the shops were closed, and this was like all the way at the bottom, and for whatever reason, this, I think it was called Anime City, had a bunch of like toku stuff. Some of like toku stuff are really old. So that was like super, this was a really nice find, actually. Um, I already unboxed this because I was planning to put this in a plastic container. Because I really like keeping the box in like really good condition. But it didn't fit. Oh, this is just the whatever. <clears throat> so I'm not a huge fan, like, not, not huge fan, but I just haven't seen enough uh, Wind Inspector or Metal Hero series stuff. Like, the best... The most knowledgeable one is probably, like, the VR Troopers for the 90s show. So, here's his gun, his saber, and he has different uh, two pairs of hands. I haven't even taken this guy out of the plastic yet. Oh, but this guy's fresh. Heard you could... Pull up his uh, visor, which is really sick. He has some plastic bits that we need to pull out. Oof. Let me see if I can pull it out. There we go. There we go. Very sick. <clears throat> Rotation and armor wise, let's see his shoulder pads go up. He gets a pretty nice T pose. Uh, he doesn't have a really good spread at all. His uh, thigh armor is kind of blocky. He does have a really nice hidden like double deeded joint. You don't really notice it, but yeah, that's pretty nice. You get the toe flex, the ankle. A little swivel in the ankle. Uh, barely any like flex. Oh. I don't know what I did, but well, I guess you could really get a good back bend. But this guy's not the most articulate. One uh, came out in like 2016. Two, he's very armored up, so it's like kind of hard to work around that. But yeah, pretty sick. Check out some of the accessories. Is like mini shotgun, no clue. I've only seen one one episode because uh, I think they, the Tokusatsu channel posted a couple episodes on YouTube, and I just stumbled upon a couple of them. This sits oh perfectly, and then his saber or whatever you call it, it's right here, and then swap out his hands. Let's see, pretty easy, pretty pretty easy. Alright, let's see how that we can spread it out. But this is the wrong hand. 
I'd say put this in the hand first. Yeah, so this was pretty much just sitting in the back shelf for like years, I would, I would assume. Because, I mean, someone could have obviously retaped it, but there didn't seem to be any tape breaks on there. Oh, I forgot to show you the head movement. Yeah, it's a pretty solid piece, honestly. Really love that, this guy in my collection, you know. I have zero Metal Hero, um... SH figure arts because I wasn't that big of a fan like actually no I lied it wasn't VR Troopers it's probably like Beetleborgs and then VR Troopers that were like really big just the, the ones that got American released you know but yeah pretty sick pretty pretty cool Time to unbox this other figure. Just, just getting it out of the way, cause uh, I just really want to get these out. You know what I'm saying? Jetto, 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 man. Da -na -na -da -na -na -na. Yeah, or else I would have had like lighting for this and like probably good close-up shots, but. <clears throat> I really was like surprised at some of like the pricing for some of the other stuff. Like, uh, I saw some a couple Ultraman SH figure arts and like some more well known stores, and they had like two hundred dollar SH figure arts for Ultraman, which was like they're like really old, and you can probably find them for like sixty to forty dollars, right? It's insane how much some of them were. I'm like, this doesn't ma not make any sense at all. Oh, this is so much plastic bits. This was worth though. They were both 90 bucks, but look at how much this one came with. And this is so much older too. This came out in 2012, bro. Like, god dang. Isn't that crazy? Unopened too. Ooh, let's just take let's just take a quick look at the figure, bro. Golly gee, let's look super clean. And you definitely see some of like the old like SH figure design where like it looks it's very lengthy and skinny. Oh I'm sorry. The camera's not like positioned at an angle, so yeah. It looks super good. Oh I know why it's not light up. How about this? Some backlighting. Literally nothing wrong with this figure. This looks beautiful. At all. Nothing wrong. Your, you know, pretty much generic uh, joints. It has the drop down knees, which is great. I mean, not knees, thighs. Get some really nice poses. Ooh, look at that, dude. Beautiful. Double jointed elbows. Head is uh all right. Can't look back at all. There's no bend back. Just a little bit of ab flex to joints. It's really nice. Like, it's pretty solid up front, and then there's like a little bit of like boot detailing right here, which is a nice touch. And everything on the paint, the artwork is on point. It's beautiful. I don't really own that many Sentai figures. I only own three, and two of them are kind of the same. I got a Gokai one, Gokai Red. 
And oh my god, look at the accessories this man comes with. Holy smokes, bro. Should we get his blaster and his opened wing form? And then you get the blaster and it's not open wing form. Really? Oh, wait, it wasn't focused. Really nice detail all around. My god. Super clean blasters. There is his blade. Oh, and then this. I guess they couldn't make a holding hand for this, so they just included the hand. So you have to attach this to his body. I don't know what this is. I'm not a, uh... I'm trying to catch up on Jetman, so... Is that? But Jetman's... So far, the first episode is actually really sick. So I guess this is the... This is the blade. On Chief. And then you can attach both of these to its side. Jetto, 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 man. So, let me make sure which side is the correct side. Look at that. So, what you do is get this in here. Oh, it's like perfect, dude. Ooh, like that. And then you get his blaster. Lock it in here. Yeah, I think this is the correct way. Oh man, what else do you get? His wings. Flexible plastic, kind of flexible. Now what did these do? They just attached this back? Oh! So, I believe... Oh fuck. I think you can take this off, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not sure how to do that, I'll do that later. Let's check everything else. There's one more box. I don't know what this is. But I'm so glad that they included it. it makes it so much more worth. Just accessories alone <clears throat> makes it really worth. But this? What is this blaster, bro? This is like the blaster or something. There's a little joint inside that make it fold straight or a little bit angled. The blast. This has to be some sort of blaster that they all use. I'm not entirely sure. Was it this? this okay i'm not sure what this is i'm gonna have to watch more jetman and come back to you on this but yeah all around solid phenomenal figures i am so happy that i just stumbled upon these because they're so nice dude here are them standing side by side Oh man, dude, these are so cool. Fuck, I love SH figure arts, bro. The detailing is just perfect, bro.